All right, the next thing that I want to show you is how to do a transition. A transition is when you are transitioning from one clip to another, okay? Right now we are in timeline mode. Um, there are two different modes of looking at your timeline. This is uh, the timeline mode where you can continue to edit um, and extract audio and cut it up a little bit more. And there's also clip mode which just puts you, uh, shows you the clips that are, you're using. So you can arrange the order real easily. Um, so go ahead and put yourself in clip mode. Um, and what I want to do is I want to show a passage of time from clip 7 to clip 8. Okay, because it goes from a roaring fire to a bed of coals. And you can do that by going over to the editing portion of iMovie. Click on it going up to transitions, clicking, um, and I would recommend using a cross dissolve to uh, show the passage of time. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on that. Okay, iMovie is going to give you a little preview. Um, and I'm going to do, I'm going to do say uh, a slower cross dissolve, which will be about four seconds. Okay, once that's done, what you can then do is drag it from here in between both of your clips and drop it. And then this little red bar is going to come up. Basically what's happening is it's rendering the file. So it's taking this clip and that clip and sort of merging them together or cross dissolving them together. So that when you go back and play it, it's going to dissolve from the sparks flying to a bed of coals which creates the illusion of passage of time. So I'll just wait for that to render, which will only take a couple more seconds, and then I'll show you what I can on my screen of how that will work. Okay, so now it's done rendering. I can go up here and I can click play. So if I click play, So there's the cross dissolve from sparks into a bed of coals.